All right, now I'll go into rendered mode. And let's start assigning some materials. Now, the subject of materials has to do with the render engine that you're using. So by default here in Rhino, I've got Rhino Render as the active render engine, but some other plugins that exist that are options for you are Brazil, NXT, uh, V-Ray, uh, Fry, Maxwell. There are many more that I don't have installed. And uh, what we can do here is use the Rhino Render Material Editor. So if I right click any of the panel headers over here, go to Materials, you can create materials here or you can go into Properties and for this selection there's a material section. So let's do it this way. We'll change Assign Material by Object and then you get this default material layout. Let's just change our color like that and in rendered mode you'll automatically see that. I'll do the same thing for this one. Okay, something like that should be good. And for the transparency on this section of the handle, I'll give this a light blue color. And I'll make it about 92% transparent. Now in the rendered mode, you don't see any um, refraction of the grid or objects uh, behind this because the render display mode is just happening off of the graphics card. But when we do an actual rendering, uh, which is called ray tracing, the refraction quality of this material will come into play. And this index of refraction here indicates what type of bending light goes through as it passes through the material. And if you right click there, you can choose from a list and I'll choose plastic, which is 1.46. So no change in the display mode because this is just on the graphics card, um, but the rendering would show it. And let me display the grip again. And change this color. And maybe just for the sake of the display right now, I won't have this be completely transparent like that. I'll just do something like that. And then we'll increase the reflectivity a little bit. Now, what is it reflecting? It's reflecting whatever the environment is right now. And that environment can be seen if you open up the environment panel. And there's no environment there. So it's really just a solid gray color at the moment. And you can create a new uh, environment by going into the plus symbol here and starting with a basic environment. And there are a few environments already included. And I'll use Rhino Interior here, which will give us some nice reflections there.